evaluate integration from 0 to 1 1 upon 7 to the power greatest integer of 1 upon x with respect to x first step is change the limit from 0 to 1 to 1 to 0 and rest of the thing remains as it is and on changing limit we change this sign because that's the fundamental property b integration from a to b fx dx is equal to minus integration from b to a fx dx so this is the property and we applied it here so just by reversing the limits we get negative sign here here this 1 upon x will always give us the integer here I can say x will always be equal to 1 upon integer integral becomes minus as it is integration starts from 1 to 1 by 2 1 upon 7 to the power 1 into dx plus because 1 upon x will give us the integer and similarly integration from 1 by 2 to 1 by 3 1 upon 7 square dx plus integration from 1 by 3 to 1 by 4 1 upon 7 cube dx plus so on up to infinity on integrating we get minus as it is 1 upon 7 into x from 1 to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 7 square x from 1 by 2 to 1 by 3 plus 1 by 7 cube into x from 1 by 3 to 1 by 4 plus so on up to infinity and this eventually becomes minus as it is 1 upon 7 applying the upper bound and lower bound we get 1 by 2 minus 1 plus 1 by 7 square into 1 by 3 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 7 cube into 1 by 4 minus 1 by 3 plus so on up to infinity again now on simplifying this 1 by 7 plus 1 upon 2 into 7 square plus 1 upon 3 into 7 cube plus so on up to infinity minus 1 upon 7 into 2 plus 1 upon 7 square into 3 plus 1 upon 7 cube into 4 plus so on up to infinity rewriting it again I can write it as 1 upon 7 plus 1 upon 7 square upon 2 plus 1 upon 7 cube upon 3 up to infinity minus we are doing a manipulation so I am multiplying by 7 and dividing by 7 inside the bracket so 7 outside and 1 upon 7 square upon 2 plus 1 upon 7 cube upon 3 plus 1 upon 7 to the power 4 upon 4 and plus so on up to infinity in this step here we multiplied and divided by 7 so that's why this 1 upon 7 became 1 upon 7 square and 1 upon 7 square here becomes 1 upon 7 cube and similarly 1 upon 7 cube becomes 1 upon 7 to the power 4 and this process goes on now since we know that the expansion of log of 1 plus x is x minus x square by 2 plus x cube by 3 minus x to the power 4 by 4 plus so on up to the infinity and similarly log of 1 minus x is minus of 
x plus x square by 2 plus x cube by 3 plus x power 4 upon 4 plus so on up to infinity using these expansions but before applying the expansion i use one manipulation here so i add 1 upon 7 and subtract 1 upon 7 here so this first bracket becomes minus of log of 1 minus 1 by 7 minus 7 times second bracket becomes minus of log of 1 minus 1 by 7 and this minus 1 by 7 I write it here so from this term to 1 by 7 here all these terms becomes minus of log 1 minus 1 upon 7 and this first bracket here becomes this minus log of 1 minus 1 upon 7 and this minus 1 upon 7 remains here this becomes minus log of 6 by 7 on simplifying and minus 7 into minus of log of 6 by 7 minus of 1 by 7 on further simplifying we get minus log of 6 by 7 plus 7 times log of 6 by 7 plus of 1 and this finally becomes 6 log of 6 by 7 plus of 1